Loft and bounce. I do think bounce is maybe the most least understood thing with amateurs, but yet one of the things where I think you'll see the least amount of games. So I do think you can get bounces that help. So great idea, just a real rule of thumb when it comes to trying to work out what bounce you need. You want to work out what's your worst part of your chipping. So let's say I hate bare lies. Maybe more bounce, bigger soles might help on the bare lies a little bit, get, you know, not so diggy. But then when you try that wedge with that bounce, you want to put it in a situation where you're average and good and make sure it doesn't affect that. So you want to try and make gains in your worst part with different soles, different grinds, how you might sit the club on the ground, those kind of things. But make sure it doesn't take away from your better part. So if you get a big sole on there, and then there's like a medium lie that you like and you kind of get a bit diggy and that's your best strike and it doesn't work as well. And then you're kind of, you're not actually gaining, gaining yeah. one and losing in the other. 